Hello? Yeah, Vito, we got a situation here. Grab a gun and meet me at the bar, and make sure you're driving a decent set of wheels. All right, I'll be right there. There goes my Sunday. Morning, Eddie. Hey, Vito. I'd like to introduce you to somebody. Vito, this is Carlo Falcone. Pleasure to meet you, Mr. Falcone. Vito? So, Vito, how do you feel about Alberto Clemente and Luco Gorino? Well, honestly, Mr. Falcone, the way I see it, those assholes tried to steal 5,000 bucks from me and then left me to rot in jail. That's good. Because the two of them are planning to make a move on us. So it looks like we're going to have to do something before they do something. Eddie will tell you the rest. I'm sure you won't let me down. Goodbye, Mr. Falcone. Nice to meet you, Vito. So what the hell's going on? A car with three of our guys in it disappeared last night. And word around town is that Luca might have had something to do with it. Who's missing? Harvey Beans and the two guys who were supposed to be protecting him, Tony Balls and Frankie the mm -hmm. Mick. Yeah. Beans is Carlo's accountant. If he talks, we're all fucked. What do you need me to do? I need you to wait for him in front of Freddy's and follow him to find out if he's involved. And then? If you find out that he had anything to do with this, you whack the bastard. And if any of our guys is still alive, try and rescue him. Hopefully you can find him before they spill the beans about our operation. Where do you think he'll go? I got no idea. So go prepared. Make sure you've got a fast car and some firepower. All right, no problem. Okay, stop by here when you're done. And Vito, don't tell nobody about this. Got it. Take care of yourself, sir. This is Luca's car. Now, where are you, Luca? There you are. Okay, here we go. I shouldn't get too close. I gotta make sure Luca doesn't see me. Where are you going, Luca? Riverside. Ruski's junkyard, maybe. Nah, Mike doesn't get involved in shit like this. Clementi's slaughterhouse, of course. Looks like Eddie was right. Okay. I gotta get in there without being seen. Looks like I can pry this off. Jesus Christ, that reeks! Dog could be a problem. Would you shut up? What, somebody there? There's nobody there, see? So shut up before we turn you into meatloaf. What was it, what? Shit, there they are. Now I got you, you skinny little prick.
Okay, time to move. Having one fucking smoke. Relax. Yeah, heard that one before, pal. So, uh, you still thinking about quitting? Shift's over. What do you mean, shift's over? You got shit in your ears? I said you're done for today. But I ain't done pounding the beefsteak. All right, fine by me. Damn straight. Let's go. Uh, be right there. Gonna go down to the track today, and Luca calls the system. I think I don't know about the dope. I know where you got the money. Falcone thinks he's got a good racket going, but he ain't gonna get away with it. Come on, how'd you get it into the States? I don't know anything. I'm just an accountant. Don't fuck with me, you egghead bastard. You wanna end up just like your buddy here? Come on, take a good look. You think you're tougher than him? After we're done with you, we're gonna grind you up in one of these machines here. <laughs> it's it's just a question who are they gonna be nice enough to fucking kill you first? <laughs> hey, what's that fucking stench? Oh. Hey, hey, somebody's Drop. over there. Hey, who the fuck are you supposed to be? <laughs> Jesus Christ, what what is Captain Shitbag here to save the day? Shut the fuck up, Luca. Hey, I know you. You're the chump who was hanging around with that moron, Barbaro. I thought you were still rotting in the can. What the fuck you think you're doing here? Falcone sent me. He isn't too fond of skinny little cocksuckers trying to turn his guys into mincemeat. So, you joined up with Falcone, huh? Well, I'll tell you what. If you knew what was really going on, you'd realize that you was better off in jail. But that don't matter now anyway. <laughs> <laughs> 